Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of Spitting Venom, aka The Venom Vlog, and today we're actually opening up some Venom mail. I had a couple things come in the mail this past week, and I've been holding on to them, waiting to share them with you guys. Uh, so first up, we're going to give out a digital code here. Uh, I got my latest issue of Venom. In the mail, it is the ending to the Nativity story. Uh, this issue I really liked a lot. So as you know, I buy them every month at the comic store and I give out those digital codes, but then like a two or three weeks later, I'll get that issue again in, uh, you know, sent straight to my house. So I got a subscription to Venom Comics and they come in the mail, which is awesome. So if you want to get a subscription for yourself, if you're not near a comic store and you wanna make sure you don't miss an issue of Venom, I'll put a link down below to the Marvel website where you can get, I think like 40% off if you get 12 issues. So that's 30 bucks for 12 comics that gets sent right to your door. Uh, so that's pretty awesome. Depends on the mailman if they come in good condition or not. This one actually came in pretty good condition, so I'm excited. So boom, there's the digital code. First person to put that in gets the code. Thank you guys so much for supporting the channel. And I'll have a ton more uh, digital codes coming up because actually what I'm going to be opening up in this box is full of digital codes. Uh, I ordered, uh, you know, back when I got my tax return in, I decided to spend like 30, 40 bucks on myself and get myself some variant covers because the biggest thing is I don't collect a ton of variants. I'm not a collector in that way. I just like buying comics for the stories and I'll buy them in print or digital, whatever, you know, I can get my hands on as long as I can just keep reading and ingesting stories. And so uh, so I'm not very really big on digital covers, but the reason I bought these, or variant covers, but the reason I bought these is because I wanted to give out these digital codes back when we were gonna do the Venom 30th birthday thing and I gave out 30 digital codes. Luckily I had 30 to give out anyway. I went and bought some other comics at my local comic store and supported them too. So these are all extra. So throughout the month, I'm gonna be giving these out randomly on random videos. So make sure you're subscribed here and that you don't miss out. And just in the, in the middle of a video, could be at the beginning of a video, the middle of a video, or near the end of a video. But pretty much every couple, every other couple videos, uh, starting this week, starting on Monday, I'm gonna just give out these codes. And these are a bunch of Marvel comics that came out recently that had Venom covers. Uh, they were Venom variants. So a lot of these books aren't even about Venom. Uh, they're, you know, they're about other characters like X-Men and all that stuff. And so, yeah, I just want to give out these codes. So throughout the month to continue the 30th, you know, birthday of, uh, of Venom, we're going to give out these codes. And forgive me, they package these really well. So, uh, and so I'm not, I'm not even slightly mad. <laughs> they pit package these so well to make sure that they came in in great condition. And then also, uh, I still have to give away, I'll give out probably one set by the end of this month and one more set we'll save for like June or something. I have an entire run of Venom, Venomized issues one through five, and I'm gonna give out all the digital codes to one person. I'll pick a random winner. We'll do some kind of contest, you know, somewhere on Instagram or on Facebook or something, and I'll give those out. Uh, and we also already gave out the Venom movie posters, um, and then we also have like the prints, which I still have one of these to give out at some point down the road. I'm still trying to think of, you know, what to do with that, but we might do that. Maybe if I do a live stream here on YouTube, we'll, we'll give it away or something. Uh, but for now, let's look at these real quick. We have X-Men Gold number 25, and it has a uh, homage cover to, you know, the Venom in his Venom jacket, uh, Eddie Brock in his Venom jacket, which is a really cool scene from Amazing Spider-Man, I think, issue uh 374 or 375 so i think it was 375 um so we got those we have some sketch covers so when i do my uh patreon show and i'm doing creative streams these some of these i bought so i could draw on them so these are going to be some of my canvases that i'm going to be working on doing drawing streams or painting whatever i can come up with uh the doctor strange cover that has the five symbiotes from the life foundation on it so there's a digital code in all these books we're going to give them all out uh old man logan i had to get this because it's punisher and uh venom and you know what punisher was in vietnam as well so hopefully we get a frank castle reference in that venom vietnam book that's coming out that we talked about in the last episode um obviously i had to get this one too it's scarlet spider versus venom uh from x-men red number three so we got that cover uh daredevil 601 so we got that one with Ghost Rider. Had to get one with Ghost Rider. This is a great scene. All new Wolverine 33. It has Venom with the church bells. When he's fighting Spider-Man, you can see Spider-Man webbed up in the church bell. Uh, so that's a great moment from that book. Uh, Avengers No Surrender. That's a great homage cover there. Uh, so we'll have digital codes for that to give out. X-Men Blue. This one actually ha ties into Poison X. There's like an, a six-page story in here that sets up Venomized. Uh, right after Venom X, it's them coming back to Earth and getting near Earth's atmosphere. So there's like a little six-page Venom story in there. So that's pretty cool. Uh, and then we have the Mark Bagley covers here of Venomized um, numbers one through five. And these are all connecting covers. Um, with, uh, you know, each of them connect to each other. 
So uh, this set here, all the digital codes, I will give out to somebody as well. Uh, so yeah, you guys uh, have been supporting me a lot here, and that's why anytime I have any extra money, which is very rare for me, I try to buy some extra books to give out digital codes to share these things, because I want to support these books. I want people to go out and buy them. Uh, whether I love them or hate them, that's just my opinion. I think you guys might have different opinions on stuff, so I try to encourage you to go to your local comic store or get a monthly subscription from Marvel themselves and uh, you know order some books, whether it's Venom or another character that you love definitely do it have it sent right to your house or support your local comic store that's really big to keep these stores open because a lot of them have been closing the past few years and uh you know and i want to make sure as someone who's worked in four comic book stores throughout my whole life and has shopped in like you know 100 maybe 100 of them uh throughout the country i definitely want to make sure as many of them stay open as possible uh, so, you know, find the nearest one to you and go buy your comics there. So, yeah, this is all I have for today's episode. Coming up this week, we're going to do Marvel Tsunami Venom. We're going to talk about the 18-issue Daniel Way run. So on Monday, we're going to review and talk about Shiver. On Tuesday, we're going to talk about Run, which is Venom versus Wolverine. Uh, and then on, on Wednesday, we're going to talk about Patterns, which is a three-issue story that tells you the backstory of this new Venom symbiote that showed up. And then we're going to do Twist, which is the finale of that story. And then on Friday, we're going to end the week with Venom the Hunger, which is from Spectacular Spider-Man, written by Paul Jenkins, one of the greatest uh, runs of that book. I love that I love that writer. Paul Jenkins is amazing. Humberto Ramos does the art. It's really great, and it also introduces the cancer storyline for Eddie Brock. So I know a lot of you guys have been wanting me to talk about that for a while, so we're finally going to get to it on Friday. So, and then make sure you're subscribed, so throughout this week, you know, on a couple of those episodes that I just mentioned, we're going to give out some digital codes on there, so be ready. And make sure you check out Unknown Comics. If you're out there and you're not near a comic store that has very or your comic store doesn't get variants or you go in every week and they sell out like I do and all the comic stores around here are sold out of them um, definitely check out Unknown Comics they get a lot of really cool variant covers that are even exclusive to them and they did a bunch for the Venom number one issue and they definitely have like Tyler Kirkin does a lot of art for them they have a lot of artists that are working with them specifically to come up with you know original covers just for their store and you can order them online they're very great about ordering a bunch and giving anyone in the country or in the world a chance to get them so make sure you check out unknown comics link is down below so that's it for this episode thank you guys so much for watching like share subscribe all that fun stuff and i'll see you in the future peace